We're in Hartwell, Georgia, but since we're on Lake Hartwell, that's how I always address the show. And it's an absolutely beautiful lake. Second season here, and the people have really taken us in here in this community. I think they enjoy the fact that we come here and support the economy, and we're pretty easy to pick out in town. <laughs> the community has really taken us in, and we feel like this is our new home. I think the challenge has really set the pace for me because that's what I'm most involved with. Melissa sees a little bit more of the reality than I do, so she could probably speak to more of that, but I think the challenges are a little bit more complex, a little bit more demanding of the contestants, and I've really enjoyed the, that factor, and it's a thrill a minute, lots of uh, excitement, and we're really pushing these people a lot harder than we have in the past. I personally love the drama aspect, you know, being a fan of reality TV and now coming in. And Steve and I are at most of the challenges. I do get to come into the house and talk with the guys and really see what's going on. And it's funny to see from week one how close everybody is and it's a tight knit bond to the very end when it's cutthroat, they can smell that money. It gets really competitive. Friendships, romances, alliances, everything is broken. It's interesting. I, I enjoy that part of it. But has, has during the competition, the fact that the competitors help each other so much surprised you? Because like you said, you're no stranger to reality television, but in, during the competition, they're very helpful to each other. You don't see that dynamic in a lot of challenges. They do help each other out. There's a lot of friendships in this house. There's a few romances. I don't think you even knew about all the romances in this house. With that, of course, comes breakups and oh. um, yeah, I think they would help each other out and then go back to the house and like throw things at each other. Have you had to uh, deliver any kind of heartfelt advice, life lessons? Uh, I have. You'll have to tune in for that, Steve. You got it. I don't give my advice away for free. A new episode of Redneck Island, Thursday at 10, 9 central, only on CMT.